Hello there. Today, in anticipation of installing some larger wheels and tyres, I'm going to put in this AEV Procal Snap, which will allow me to change the tyre pressure monitoring system, the diameter of the tyres, and also the axle ratio. Let me show you how to put it in. The only tool you're going to need is a pick similar to this. The parts you get from AEV are a Procal snap, a wire harness, and a user guide. Under the dash below the steering wheel, you'll see the OBD2 connector and the green star connector, which is above the parking brake. Remove the OBD2 connector by pushing the two tabs on either side and then pushing it up through its housing. Remove the two gray pieces of plastic that are holding the wires in they're held in with these two clips on the side and you would need to use a pick to get these out. The cable you get in the kit is labeled with a number one which is white and a number nine which is blue. If you hold the ODB2 connector like this with the pink and red wire top right, then blue number nine is top left and white number one is bottom left. There's a barb on the side of the plug and the gray slider holds that in place. Make sure that is facing outward when you put the wire in. Once you've put the wires in, then slide the grey plates in to keep them in place. Now you can put the OBD2 connector back into its socket. Plug the white connector at the other end of the cable into an open port on the green star connector. To pair the Procal to your truck, press the engine start button twice so that it shows run. Put the Procal snap into the OBD2 connector. You should see a green flashing light on the Procal and you should see a red flashing brake light on the dashboard. Put your foot on the brake pedal and keep it there. Then press and hold the cruise control button on the steering wheel for three seconds. You should hear the horn beep three times. That means you've successfully paired the Procal to your vehicle. If you get a fast blinking orange light when you plug your Procal in, that means you installed the wires incorrectly. Go back and check your wires and try again. Okay, that's it. The Procal's installed. My only observation is that after spending that much money on a piece of kit, I would hope it would come with some sort of bag or carrying case. Fortunately, I have this little pouch and I can drop it in here and throw it in the glove box so that it's there when I need to use it. Please like this video and subscribe to the channel for more cool stuff.